What are some of the must have tools that you need as a realtor? Now this is specifically for new agents getting into the business, but even if you're a seasoned realtor, you may just pick up on something that you haven't thought about before. So as a real estate agent today, especially because everything is online, you need to have certain tools in order to do your business. And I'm going to zero in on the four must have tools that you need as a real estate professional. These are the minimum requirements. Number one, you need to have a laptop and a tablet. Yes, you heard me right. You need to have both a laptop and a tablet or a desktop and a tablet, but I prefer a laptop and you can connect the big monitor to it if you want to, because you need to have that mobility. So why do I need a tablet? Well, you need a tablet because a tablet can be used to get, you know, present documents, have people sign documents electronically right there on the spot, much, much easier than a laptop. And sometimes you just don't have, you know, the space to drag a laptop along and your tablet can be your presentation tool. It can be, um, you know, a marketing tool. So you really need to have both. Now, if you don't have the budget for both, then I highly recommend you look at the Surface Pro. Actually, I'm a Mac guy, so I have a MacBook Pro and an iPad, etc., etc. But if I weren't so Mac centric, I would personally grab one of those Surface Pros. My wife has a Surface Pro. They are awesome. They are a laptop, a true laptop, the size of a tablet. And you can just pull off the screen and you have a tablet or you have a full blown laptop and you can plug it into a large monitor, large keyboard if you want to use it for that. So um, if you're a PC person, a Surface Pro may be your option if you cannot afford both a laptop and a tablet. Next, you need to have a smartphone. You need to have a late model smartphone. So I'm not talking about, you know, an iPhone 8. Um, you want to have a late model, ideally the latest model smartphone that is available. This is your business. You're running your business on this device. So you want to have the fastest, best, most advanced tool that you can have with the fastest processor, the best camera, etc., etc. And you want to have as much memory as possible so you can save lots of videos photos, etc., on that item. I'm totally agnostic. Personally, I use an iPhone. My wife has a Samsung. Um, you know, whether you use Android or Apple really doesn't matter. If you're on the Apple ecosystem, then obviously you probably want to go with an iPhone. Number three, and this is very inexpensive, but a lot of agents don't have it and I don't get it, is a laser room measuring device. When you walk into a listing appointment, you have to be able to measure the room. Don't be one of those lazy agents that just pulls an old MLS listing and accepts the data from there. And, you know, and then the data is inaccurate. And the last five agents, when the property sold, have always used the inaccurate information that somebody started God knows how many years ago. You need to have a laser room measuring device that makes it super, super easy and quick to measure everything, the size of the closets, the size of the rooms, the size of the hallways. You want to have all of that information. And if you want to go a step further, uh, there are some apps on your phone that you can use to create floor plans. And personally, myself, I would always have a Matterport photography done, which includes floor plans. And if you want to go all the way up, Home Depot has, I think for $99, uh, a service where they will actually go inside and measure out and create a digital floor plan for you. Um, but at the bottom line, you want to have a laser room measuring device, less than $20. You can get it at Lowe's or Home Depot. Uh, don't leave home without it. And then number four, and this again is something that a lot of agents are saving money on, which is ill-advised, and that is a Supra lockbox. You need to have both the app for your phone so you can unlock lock boxes, but you also need to have super lock boxes for your listings. Yes, you can use combos, but you know what? Um, it's not secure. With a super lock box, you can do something called a CBS code, which is a call before showing code that you program into the lock box and you can change that every time the listing change or you can change it every week if you want to. But when somebody schedules a showing, they need to get that code from you in order to open the lockbox. And so you don't have to worry about somebody, you know, driving by with a buyer and sees a lockbox, sees a for sale sign, just decides to go in and help themselves and show the property uh, with a um, CBS code. That cannot happen. But as far as security is concerned, with a combo lockbox, you have no idea who accessed the property, when, how often, if they gave it to a friend, a buddy, 
another co-realtor and, uh, and then they go without an appointment. You just have zero control and that can lead to liability. With the Supra uh, lockbox, you can actually run a report that shows exactly who, when accessed that uh, lockbox and opened the lockbox, which you can use for reporting to your sellers, but also just as a security measure, because if something goes amiss, for example, you have proof positive who was last in that property, whereas with a combo locks, but you don't. So again, to recap real quick, a laptop and a tablet, if you can afford, cannot afford it, then get a Surface Pro, um, smartphone, laser room measuring device, and a super lockbox and lockbox key. Hope you found this helpful. My name is Thomas Hyman with Realty Partners, and please feel free to reach out to me anytime if you need more information or help with anything real estate related.